Hey guys, how are you all today? Yeah. Yeah, I am here. I'm feeling better. I can breathe. I'm sitting on my couch. The blue couch is so comfortable. This was a good purchase. It's a really good purchase. But how y'all doing? I'm doing okay. I love to feel. Is it me or do you all like to feel couches? And yeah, but we're not gonna get into that. I am here with my two Fozzy Bear ponytails, right? I promise y'all, I'm gonna give you the video. But before we get into all that, let me just say this. I know it's been a while. Uh, I tried to do a live, which was an epic fail. I tried to do a live. I tried to post that I was going to do a live for you all so you can know what's been going on. So I've been sick and my internet and all of that has not been cooperating with me. It's been down, it's slow, all of that or whatever. So I'm in the process of getting that rectified and getting new internet service right so I can continue with the videos for you all. But on top of that, I had an upper respiratory infection and I have been having, like the time that I've been on YouTube, it's probably the length of time that I had it. So a lot of the things that I delight here in this business, blood pressure up, all that, that was probably because of the upper respiratory infection. And I didn't know that. And I had been going back and forth to the doctors until I started coughing up the mucus and it was green. It was green. Yep, it was this color green. And then I was like, you know, I just, I'm not feeling good. But that, you know, I was like, well, maybe it's just because I do have bronchitis, asthma, bronchitis. I was like, well, maybe that's just that. But no, the way it started making me feel. So I went to the hospital to be destroyed for a headache, a migraine, because it was like, this migraine was like so bad. Like, it was worse than, I didn't have my mind. It was worse than any, I've never felt that pain anymore. So they gave me some drugs that made me shake and be jittery. Bowen's Hospital did. Not going back there either. Uh, Bowen's Hospital did. And uh, they had to give me Benadryl. It wasn't really helping. So they gave me some more Benadryl. So I'm still jittery when I got home. Only for me to go back out to go to the hospital to the Mercy Urgent Care. Shout out to Mercy Urgent Care. For them to give me some antibiotics and for them to give me uh, some steroids, which I'm not taking steroids anymore. Uh, the steroids, no, my body says no. I can't deal with that because it sends me, sent me into the panic attack and it's still wearing off. Like I'm not really feeling the symptoms like I was because I've been really eating right and trying to do something. So I loaded that video up. Because these videos that I'm loading up are prior to. So even though that I wasn't feeling my best, I was still making videos. But I just wasn't able to post them because of the internet issues and all of that. But I'll explain all of that when I'm posting a video. So just know that these this is today's video, which is Monday, right? Monday, um, the April 21st, I think it is. Is it April 21st? April 23rd. Ooh, okay. April 23rd. Um, so this is Monday. This is the most current video, right? Uh, so the other ones are old videos, but I'm just posting them now. But I do. I am going to start going live. So comment down below and let me know when would be a good time for you all. Because I have viewers all over the country, all over the world, right? So... Um, I want to be able to try to like make them so maybe in the evening time like at around 6 or 7 when people are like winding down or whatever so just drop some comments down below and give me some times and then I can like work with it and then I can like tell you all when I'm going to post and then you'll be on alert but I'll try to do a post first before I go live right because I was doing a live to tell you all that this is why I haven't been doing the videos because I couldn't post because of the internet right <sighs> spectrum you got to do better but anywho I feel much better than what I am I have been feeling so right now I got a little scratch in my throat and I'm going to take my ginger tea I'm gonna try to drink this every day because I did stop the uh, steroids so I'm still trying to get my airways to be open 
and uh, without having to feel like I'm losing my mind to doing so. So I'm going to put that tea bag in her and I got some stevia packets that I am going to put in here because uh, this is good for diabetics and good just period because it's like it's a plant instead of like the sugar. Sugar is not soluble. This is and it will not <clears throat> sit on sit in your bloodstream on you know so doctors recommend you know this to most diabetic uh, patients because it's like the regular insulin that's in your body so able to break that down so i'm gonna be drinking this and i come on here today because yeah my hair is like this but do i have the strength to do anything else i don't i'm still not at that point uh i thought my brother curls i'm sure you load that up for y'all too would last longer than it did but it did and because i was sick and i wasn't really taking care of it the way i need to so these are some of the options it's dry it needs to be washed so i'm gonna I'm wash it just not right now so i'm sitting here and i got like my scarves headbands you know things or whatever near me because i'm just going to show you all what I do, right? Um, when I still want to look decent and I need to get up and go, right? And natural hair allows me to do this. I don't wear wigs in the uh, I don't wear wigs in the summertime, and I'm probably going to just stop wearing them all together uh, and just wear my hair. There's no reason for me not to wear my own hair, but. Mm -hmm. That's good. My hair gives me the diversity, a versatility to um, be able to manage it in different ways and be able to have one look in one day without having to say, oop, I, or if the rain, I don't have to be bothered about the rain because my hair is natural. So I'm not going to mess it up or anything like that. Oh, that feel good going down. Now, in the meantime, while I'm doing this, I'm still doing self-care, right? This is Monday. Is this Monday or Tuesday? This is Tuesday. My bad, y'all. It's April 20th, Tuesday, April 23rd. I did self-care Monday, too. I'm still getting into the week because I need a little bit more attention to get myself back to where I am but I got a pot of water on the stove and I'm letting the steam what you hear in the background is the blower I let the steam come in there because this is going to be a whole personal sauna and my skin is getting better as you can see I want the glow and all of this so I'm sitting up here with this sweat on but it's a little cool it was a little cool outside and it's been raining so I am going to uh just take advantage of this I may be coming up out of this sweater when it gets a little too hot in here but i'm steaming my hair my face i'm doing all of this at one time and i'm also showing you some of the ways i wrap my my hair my scarves my bands my um uh, turbans you know all of that or whatever so yeah just i'm here i had to get some more of this because my throat was tickly feels so good but I'm also I'm gonna show you all I'm not a makeup person right I don't make wear makeup but I'm gonna line my lips when I'm doing a different thing so you all can see I got like two little lip glosses here so I think this would be fun but before we get started I have here my massager let's just make this real extra y'all and I'm going to strap it. I'm going to strap it here. You can adjust it according to how you want to. And I'm going to turn it on. I won't do it too loud, but it, it, and I can sit back like this. Oh my. And it kind of like massages my neck, right? feels real good so i'm sitting here and i'm doing it 
But as I'm talking to you guys, <clears throat> yeah, I was pretty messed up and I have been sitting here. I've been laying on this couch for like a week. I finally slept in the bed last night. I'm telling you. So I'm just putting oil, which is olive oil, in my head. Because I do have to do I do have to wash it and everything, but I'm just gonna oil it up because my hair is spongy and it eats grease like crazy. But I like the versatility of my hair. It's spongy, but it's really soft and it's curly. And I put those Bantu knots in there. So I am just going to, I'm just rubbing that oil in. Just kind of massaging it through. You know, and once I massage it through, because it's still some curls in there. So I'm going to try to keep what I do have. And I'm going to do this one the same way. And I'm just going to massage it through, right? And I'm gonna show you how I just play with it and it turns out right. That's one thing about natural hair. You can play with it and sometimes it'll give you the results you want, sometimes it don't. So that's why you got head scarves and all of that, right? So you just go through it with the oil. And especially that center part had been tender. So I'm gonna spray it with some oil up in here and then kind of like massage it. Yeah, that feels good. Oh my God. Well, I really need to go back to my beautician and let her do some styles that she won't because I asked her to do more natural styles than, per I don't want it to be uh, silk pressed at this moment. Because uh, it's not going to last. We're going to have an extremely hot summer. I can feel it. I already know it, right? So, I'm just going to play with it a little bit more. Now, if I pass out, come and get me back and resuscitate me because this heat is going up in here. I was not turning my heat on. I went old school and either turn that stove on, the oven which we weren't going to do that. Or, not. why not just have a facial in your house, heat your house up at the same time, right? So, yeah. Let's see, this one had not came all the way down or whatever, but that's okay. So, I'm just going to go through it. And see, already I can think of one style, you know, like this. Just, and then I can take my bands, or I can take, I can just do like a ponytail, right? And just come in, and not even put too much on it, because I don't like tight things on my head. And let's say we start out from there, right? We're just going to start out from here. We're going to put it up like that. And I told y'all I don't wear makeup, but I do, but I don't. I don't wear foundation or anything. to line my lip. And this probably needs to be sharpened. And I can't really see. We need to put these glasses on with it. Because this is not the best light.
it's usually better than this. But I'm going to take these off because they're getting foggy anyway. Y'all get the gist of it. I'm not gonna go on and do all of this. And the way I'm doing now, you all, I'm pretty much like this all the time. Lip gloss, whatever. Cause it's all gonna blend in. And I'm just gonna take a simple pink base. I usually do like brown or bronze or something or nude. So, yeah, we're going to do something like this. And you guys know, should I start off with the scarves first? Let's do the headbands. Even though these are not the colors, so don't even look at the attire right here. But I can do something like this. Right? I can bring it back further if I want to to do something like that, but it's not tight enough. But I can do something like this. And with natural hair, it's okay for it to be a little messy, right? So that can be something that I do, or I can just take it and do it like this. I think I like it better back because I don't like stuff in my face. So, like this, right? Now, the hair may start doing something different because this humidity, because the heat, it, the steam is in here. But it's okay because it's, it's okay to steam your hair. It really is. It helps it out. Or we can do back black. We can do black. Can do something like this right we can do it like this this little piece don't want to act right okay we can do it like this it can go further back like this you know you can bring it back and you know we can do that you can pin it up in the back, whatever you want to do, or you can just take it and just have your hair without the ponytail in it and just have it in a band and just out, right? Let's see. Okay, so. So we can have it like this as well. And that back, I don't know what it be doing sometimes because I can't see back there right now. So I'm not going to worry about it. So we can probably get away with it for a minute or we can just have it up like this. Like a mohawk. You know, something sort of. So it's a lot of ways that we can play with it. Or we can just take it back and just get something that's really tight to go back. Right? And just have it like this. So that was that. Let's see what this is. I've never used this. I think it came with a wig. But I kind of like got a little idea from just putting it on my head. So, we can have it back like this, but then we can also put 
put it back up in that ponytail and I'm not going to put it back on here right now because I'm out I'm not going to do that my head so we can have it up like this or we can just have it like this so these are just like summer ways where you can like take it over to the side and do some things with it um there's so many different things you can do and like i said you can put it in the mohawk you can bring it forward you can bring it more forward to your face you know do something like that with it it's different ways that you can play with it right so that's why i like to put bantu knots up in my head because even so you can have yourself like a little uh, updo and then this little part in the back so it can be kind of like kind of like in a mohawk type of thing so you just bring the sides up and then leave the rest of it out right just bring the sides out and, and leave the rest of it out so it can be like in a mohawk but i would want it to be a little bit curly unless i'm trying to be just like really spicy and spike it right i'm not trying to do it right now so this is another one that probably came with a wig because i wouldn't have perched this uh, peacock thing but it's kind of cute now that i'm looking at it it's kind of cute you know or then you can just do that mohawk right that i was talking about with this but i wonder if this go in the back or in the front i know it's in the back still but again you can just what just do this And I wear my I wear a lot of uh, sun hats to keep the sun from beaming on my face. So you can do this, or you can just take it in a ball, right? And just do a bun, or do like a little puff ball or something like that. Very very easy to do. Mess it back up do different things so I'm gonna take that off I really don't like anything on my head like my head is really sensitive and I really don't like a lot on my head Ooh, that is working because I can feel like the sinus is draining I have to do my nitty pot tonight excuse me and I love this one because I was thinking about doing something like this and kind of like taking it over to the side but have my curls, you know, somewhat like this. Well, that'll be up. So sometimes when you want to go and do a side, instead of just having it, you know, just do something like that over there. So with natural hair, there's a lot of ways that I can do it and get away with it. And it'll still be cute, you know, or you can just let it down right and just you know just have it like a, a, a look like this but of course you know do a little bit more to it you have to go through it and especially when I wash it I have to go through it and y'all it's getting hot up in here I don't want to turn the and I think my sinuses got my mmm I think it got it, um, a little swollen, but that's okay. I'm going to do my Navy pot tonight. And it's really doing something. I can feel it. And I can take it like this. And these are my headbands, right? You can have it up like that. You 
you can do a pony like this. I'm gonna do it on the right. Do pony. So guys, I'm back. Yeah, I told you all that I was going to have to come up out of this, out of that sweater because my eyes look a little swollen, but that heat is just really getting it. I don't want to dehydrate myself either. So I think I left off with this, right? I think I left off with this. Like I said, you can just do whatever you want to do with it. Right? At this point, uh, do however you want to do with it because you can actually have this going over to the side with curls in it and this back. You know, they do have clips now, the uh, texture of your hair, and you can wear the clips. So that's enough of that. And here, if you don't feel like doing that, maybe you want to take it and, uh, I don't know, just say you want to do something like this, right? I'm improvising here, y'all. I'm just improvising, right? Because my head is a little sore. So I'm going to do these, get this, and just put it over. I can do it like this, tuck it up under, have me like a a neat little thing or whatever. Oh, where's my earrings? Right here. And I am in the phase of my life to where uh, health is very important to me. It always has been. But what I'm doing now is I'm, I'm working out more. So I'm going to sweat more. My hair is going to sweat more. So I need to have that flexibility to be able to do styles that will uh, complement my uh, hair to where, okay, I can still work out and don't have to worry about, ooh, I can't work out. I have to do this. I have to do that because my hair, it's going to get messed up. So I'm not in that phase anymore. I'm out of it. And I'm probably, for the most part, I said I was going to grow my hair out completely. I'm going to give myself a year. We'll see. I don't know because I get still that happy sometimes, right? So we'll see. Um, but yeah, you can do it like that. Also, you can untuck it, right? You can also wear it as a mask, guys. You can untuck it and... Again, just do whatever you want to do with it. You can braid it up. But these are just some simple things. And my hair is a mess, but or you can just go even further and put it up like that and have your hair, you know, somewhat like that. Or, you know, however you want to do it. But I get like these little things. I took that last band too not because I had forgot it was in there. It was really curly like this. But again, humidity here in St. Louis, you never know what you may get. Uh, but of course, you guys know my favorite scarf, right? Favorite in the world. And I can just go and step over. And then I can just tie it and tuck it. And this for the most part this is like how I wear it I used to tie it but I don't want that much tension because it sometimes give you a headache so I just take it and I tuck it up under or and that way you can probably wear it for the rest of the night you can also have it up like this you can put it in a ponytail you can put it in a puff ball you can either separate it and do like I did today and put it in two puff balls right and while I'm doing that because that's exactly what I did 
Look at uh, you can just put it in two puff balls or just two. Uh, you can add weave to it if you want to, or you don't have to. You can just take it back like this. You don't have to have it right on your head. You know, again, you can do that. You can uh, just like play with it. You can uh, wear the scarf in different ways. Like, let's say you don't really want to do anything, right? But some days it's like that. It's just like that. I know for me it is. So I'll just go. Or you can have it out if you want to. You can have it out if you want to, or you can tuck it down and you don't have to do it. And you can wear a cute little outfit with these. You can put a hat on, like I wear like sun hats and stuff so if i just don't want to do anything i can like tie it down a little bit more and then put um put a yeah it's 723 this you know i'm starting to get back to my regular uh sleep routine to where i'm getting tired but i have to take my magnesium tonight but uh because then it really puts you to sleep i've been going to bed really uh early so you can do this uh, with your scarves. You can do just so much with it. It's so many other things, but these are just some of the things that I do, right? And that's my favorite scarf. And then I have this one. Right here. Another one of my favorites. And you can go up. That's not how I wanted it to be. Also dress this up if you want to. And I will have it better than that. And you can leave some parts of your hair out. And you don't have to leave it out. You can do it like this. And I can't wear a skirt. I mean not a skirt but a hat. Or um, uh, what they call those hats. A fedora. Uh, a sun hat. Like for vacation wear. I like to wear my sun hats a lot, so to keep the sun out of my head. But if I go on vacation, I'll probably have my hair braided up, but you can still do this with a scarf and braids and have your, you know, visor, you know, sun head on or whatever. You can do so many different things with it. Uh, or you can tie it up like this. Let's say that you're not gonna do nothing with it for real, right? Maybe I'll put this right here because I really don't want anything tight on my head. And I'm just doing it because I don't want anything tight on my head. Now, see, it's this woman that I got some of my wraps from. But. So it's kind of like you're making a band two knot, right? You're twisting, you're twisting. And then you have it like this. You can either tuck it and take up a, um, I'm just gonna tuck it like that. Or you can take a, uh, let's take this. And this is say, tuck it like this. And you can secure it if this was a little bigger. But if not, it's still other ways you can do it. So just tuck it. And maybe you'll have your hair a little bit more managed. 
but you can wear it like this as well. So I'm gonna take it out. And I'm really not gonna, you know, you get the gist of what I do with my headbands and stuff, but I love this scarf because I have I wear it with my Chuck Taylors. I wear my Chuck Taylors, my Converse, right? It has stars on it and all of that, right? If I want to be real extra, y'all, let me just tell you what I'll do. If I want to be real extra. I showed you all that I would wrap it like this, right? And sometimes I'll tie it and I'll just... do something like this and just depending on the outfit that you have um, you can do it like that but that's not what I was going to do I was going to actually just tie it in the back let's say you have on a summer dress right Make, let's say it's a, um, a casual summer dress like it's like a cotton uh, maybe like knee length or a little shorter uh, summer dress either long with some Chuck Taylors, right? And you just wear it like this. Like, who are y'all talking to? <laughs> who are you talking to? Who are you talking to? Of course, you can make it tighter. This is not tight enough, but again, I don't want to mess with my head. Oh, for y'all, things I do. Huh. So you can just have it like this. Put your big earrings on and your Chuck Taylors and you know maybe a little denim jacket because we can still work we can wear denim still like a little dim, denim jacket and nice little cute little purse um, your little clutch or whatever and you can just like excuse me what y'all talking about who y'all talking about I am a queen I am the queen what I am the queen right so you can do something like that or you can take it over on this side whichever side looks better for you you know and just whichever side that looks better for you you can do that right and you can have it like this uh you can actually put another headband around here if you want to but again me i don't like a lot of stuff tied on my head uh especially in the summertime uh now if i'm trying to be incognito I'll put a baseball cap on there and you know I would wear this and put like a baseball cap with it that's what I would do I would put a baseball cap with it and have my little baseball cap with it with my little it, 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 it me some linen capris or something or some little linen pants probably capris or shorts you can do it with shorts and your tuck take your Chuck Taylors and you know all of that or whatever nice little uh, straw bag that you can have with your little straw bag. But yeah, it's just like different little things that you can, different things that I wear. And you, I'm not gonna have it a bad hair day, I'm not. Because guess what, you ain't gonna see it and when I get ready to do it, it'll be done. It'll be done. But this one, I wear this like when I work. Uh, And they always say, Stacey, you have so, so pretty little scarf sets or whatever, little headbands. Uh, if I want to I'll tie it up like this you know but like I said you get the gist of it it's just depending on how it is how it's made but you can also make, wear it as a next scarf for now because it's too hot I mean it's too it's not that hot right now and you can get away with it right I'll show you guys something I'm choking myself I'll show you guys some of the ways to wear your scarves and what you can do with, you know, your scarves and, you know, give you a little some fashion tips and, you know, all of that. Different little things that you can do to make it, like, really cute. Oh, God. Let me 
I should have tagged that tag. Yeah, that ain't gonna well, but you, you get the gist of what I'm talking about. You can wear it just like this, you know. Just like this. I wear my other scarves. How do I do it? I do it come like. Mm. I'm getting sleepy y'all. So now um that and the other one is a blue scarf. Use your imagination. I'm not gonna really do nothing because again I didn't want this to be too long, but I do like that blue color. And I usually wear blue when I wear my uniforms and things like that. And I would go to work like this, right? I work in a medical field. So I would wear go to work like this. Uh I may do the bow so it can look cute. I'm not going to do bow right now, y'all, because I'm tired. I may do the bow. I may not. I just may go over and do it like this. Tuck it. Whatever. You get the gist, because I'm not going to have a bad hair day. Because uh, there's so many different things that you can do, and especially when your hair has just did what it wanted to do. Pretty much like mine have and you still don't have the strength to do anything but you still want to be, look nice and presentable and all of that you can accessorize and use your scarves and stuff or you can just do this i bought these from uh she was called the rap queen or something like that rap wraps or something like that off of instagram i try to support small businesses right and yeah just have this like this I'll put it on my head and bam, there you go. I can see the back if I want to. I can have, because it's already pre-knotted for you. Wear it. I sometimes wear it in the back if I want to wear a head or something. Or even if I don't want to wear a head. Pull your hair, Stacy. Okay, and I want to do it, and if I don't choose to wear a head, because you can wear it like this as well, uh, I'll put a head on there. You can actually put a sun head on there, a, a fedora, a, 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 a brim head, any type of head, because now this is in the back, so you won't have to worry about the big thing up there, so you can wear it in the back. You can put a baseball cap on here. You can put another headband on here if you feel like having all that heat to your head, because I don't. Uh, so, yeah, you can just do so many different things. And I have those little, um, I have a lot of these different colors. I bought these from like the, uh, what you call it, the little uh, A-Rad place. This is where my son said I look like I'm going scuba dive. Like snorkeling is what he said, snorkeling. And I, I may put on like a little moo, moo or a cute little outfit that got these colors in it and damn. I'm done. I'm done, y'all. Mm -hmm. You can also turn these to the back if you want to. Yeah, so there we go. And I have a little green thing. This is cute. You can really make this cute. You really can. Because I love the colors in here. The green colors. I love the colors in here. In spring and summer, you can always do fun colors vacation you know you can do and all of these like and when i'm going swimming i'm looking for a cap that i can put on my head when i go swimming because i'm going to start going swimming to help me tone and for my lungs to help my lungs right uh and i don't want my hair to get the chlorine in it so yeah i'm gonna be doing a lot of things so i really don't have time to just have my hair done like that uh i just don't and I'm not even going to stress over it. I'm not going to pay all that money or just take all that time to do it. I'll do it myself. But when I'm ready for my silk press, I know who to go to. Uh, my beautician, Coney from Styles for You. And yeah, uh, I wear this a lot. I love this because it has like basic colors in it. So you could wear it with some jeans. Again, you can turn this to the back, put your baseball cap because I am so such a little tomboy sometimes. You know, I 
dress that way i like comfortable clothes i don't like things that's really too tight on me uh it has to have like a little stretch but just to be relaxed and comfortable like i love a, a good pair of baggy sweats and baggy t-shirts and things like that uh I, I do the girly thing too but i like i like comfort that's my whole thing comfort so i try to incorporate it with style and fashion as well so what i incorporate i will share it with you all um this is my all two uh one it's black i have a white one too but i gotta wash it and you can't wash these and again this right here is and you can turn it to the back you can do whatever you want but these are my little things that i do so you're gonna probably see me in a lot of these right a lot of little things but this is kind of heavy it's kind of heavy they get kind of heavy uh that's one thing i didn't like about them they was heavy these were the thicker ones i think for the winter uh because my head came my head can't balance uh it's small anyway it can't balance a lot so but this right here like this is my arm sleeve y'all when my arms start hurting and i love purple and they only have butterflies now my friend she loves butterflies right so when i work i wear this especially when it's cold in the office you know i get like arm sleeves and all of that but look let's say you get hot and you want to put your hair up right you want to put your head and that's what that hurt i went to la and they told us that we don't use valves valves we use all consonants so uh we alleviate all of the valves y'all i was like no oh, y'all did so this is how i choose to I want the show so you can have another you can have another headband on to where you can tuck it up under yourself or you can cut it if you want to to do it that way uh, to tuck it up under you can pin it however you want to do it and you can make you something trust me and I like the flower print so you can make it have it bigger and you can get some Velcro. You get some Velcro and put it right here and right here and snap it and make it that way. You know, you can make you something. It's oh, it's something. You know, I have made leggings out of a head thing or whatever because I wanted it to match. You can just get creative and do whatever you want to do. But this is what I do want to show you before I go. Uh... wanted to show you guys right so I am going to use this again because if you want to add weave I'm not against weave I just I'm, I'm just trying to buy better weave like I, this this is black woman that's selling weave because she was saying with the stuff that they make for our braiding hair and it's causing like neurological problems and all of that and you know they kind of like design it because they're making it from like trash and all type of things like that and i'm like well maybe that's what i was feeling because you know i had that weave in my head when i had the locks so i was like i'm going to explore do a little bit more research and, and see and i'll let you guys know as well but you can just wear your hair out like this if you want to just wear it like this or have it more, a little bit more curlier have it curled than me but let me show you this so this is blonde right my hair is not blonde just imagine this is black I have a lot of braiding hair like when I want to do different styles and I just recently thought about this because I'm gonna try to do something different like I'm going to do something new, right? And if I can find the ponytail holder that I had. I had everything right here so I wouldn't have to get up. I just didn't have to get up. Y'all. Mm. I had it here. Because it held right. Yeah, I've been coloring. 
to ease my nerves, you know, to calm me down or whatever I like to color. I've been coloring. Uh, why I'm looking for that, y'all don't laugh at me. I don't care though. That pollen is about to take people over. It has taken me over and I'm sick of it. So I done walked out the house like this. Right, let me show y'all. With my mask on and my face shield. Mm. I'm not playing with this pollen. I'm sick of this pollen trying me. It's playing with me in my face. I'm tired of this pollen. Cause baby, when I tell you I stepped out there and I was <gasps> instantly, and I'm not the only one going through it. Everybody is going through it. And they said it's going to be longer, right? This year, it came sooner and it's going to be longer. That's not it, it's a little smaller. I got crayons and stuff everywhere. Oh, I'm trying to figure out where did I put it in because I just had it. Didn't I just have it? Because it really is going to give. I got more, but I just wanted to show you all. Oh, well, I'm just going to have to work with what I got. Um, so this right here is the weave, right? And then let's say if you want to do your hair in a ponytail I didn't want to put that much tension on her but let's say you want to wrap it you don't want to tuck it so you don't want to put it out in like um, let me do this better you don't want to put it out in um, just like little puff balls you want to do something a little bit more neater or uh, maybe let's say you want to go somewhere or go out or something like that so just tuck it up under right and take this take the weave and again I'm not telling you to put blind in but if your hair is blind yeah but you just want to take it right there and then just start twisting around I did better when I did it in the uh, bathroom. It looked better. But, you know, and the, the thing was better. So you can just uh, have it little b balls or whatever like that. You know, you, you get the gist of it. You can have it like that and do it with this type of hair. But of course you would do this with black. It would be black and see your hair black. This would be black. Or if your hair is blonde, this would be blonde. And it just looks like you just took taking your hair or something and wrapped it up, right? Or you can just uh, twist your hair, or either corn, roll it, right? Just keep twisting. And let's say you, you don't want to leave that out. You can... You know, I wish I had that smaller thing because these bigger ones are not working. And you can just well, of course you want to stay. You can decorate it too. It can be a coin roll. It can be a twist or whatever. But just take this and take this ball and wrap it around. And you can have two balls to the side. It's just like different ideas. And you know, like I said, they got clip on pieces and things like that. That's near natural texture that you can use and you can wear instead of having to, you know, say, oh, I can't do anything with my natural hair or anything like that. This is just what I do. I'm not a beautician or anything like that. I just, I'm a woman that does my own hair. Uh, so what I want, when I want to do it, some days I'm not gonna do it. Uh, and I'm a wear those styles that I said that I was going to wear, but excuse me. One time I braided my hair and I think this was for my 40, I want to say 48, 
birthday or something. I had on a, a little jogging set, a pant. Um, it was a little uh, short set, but it was made like this material that I have on. And I had on some Pumas, and the Pumas are this color right here. And I had took it out, baby, and I had my hair just crinkly. I think I have a picture somewhere. I had my hair crinkly, and it was, I took it down, and it was it, and it was cute, and pretty much it. So, um, I hope you all enjoyed this little, uh, this little session of me telling you what I do with my natural hair, and, um, Hopefully, hopefully gave you uh, ideas to do when you don't feel like doing hair, you don't have the money to do the hair, or you need to get up and run out quickly and all of that. You can still be cute and fashionable with it. You can accessorize because that's why it's called accessories. You can do whatever you want to do with it. And uh, and still look presentable and still look nice and comfortable and you know well kept and all of that. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. So with, uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, wind down because I'm, I'm winding down now, right? I'm taking a shower and take my magnesium and all of that. But I hope you all enjoyed this. So until next time, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Uh, don't forget to hit that like button, that subscribe button, uh, thumbs up. And uh, until next time, talk to me. Uh, I'll talk to you later. Mwah.